Welcome back to another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm Susie Selleck, and today we're near Delaware, Ohio, at the site of the former Big Ear Radio Telescope. Stay tuned. I'll tell you all about it. One half mile east of this site is the former Big Ear Radio Telescope, designed by Dr. John D. Krause, pioneering radio astronomer at Ohio State University. It had a collecting area of 340 by 70 feet. The observatory was completed in 1963. The Ohio Sky Survey recorded here between 1965 and 1972 and was the most accurate, reliable, and complete mapping of cosmic radio signals for many years. Big Ear gained fame for its ability to detect quasi-stellar radio sources, or quasars, and for its discovery of some of the most distant objects known. This observatory conducted a 24-year continuous search for evidence of extraterrestrial intelligence. Big Ear, unfortunately, was demolished in 1998. Big Ear consisted of a flat, tiltable reflector, a fixed standing parabolic reflector, and pairs of receiving horn antennas. Radio signals were bounced off the flat reflector, focused by the parabolic reflector, and collected by the feed horns. The telescope used the rotation of the Earth to scan a narrow path across the sky once each day. The Ohio State University and the National Science Foundation funded the telescope's design and construction, and it was built almost entirely with faculty and student part-time labor. From 1973 through 1997, the observatory was operated and maintained by a dedicated group of volunteer scientists with generous assistance from NASA and private benefactors. Thank you for watching another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. Today we were near Delaware, Ohio, here at the former site of the Big Ear Radio Telescope. Remember, travel slowly and stop often. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.